All right, guys, I thought I'd make a real quick video here and give you some information about this product. So here you've got the Isheen R0T G01 receiver for FPV. First off, I want to just tell you, all right, what's it, what's it used for? This is used for FPV cameras like little drone like this. You can record or somebody else can watch you flying. Uh, or even big quads like this, if you can, you know, your FPV camera on there, uh, you could see what's going to be seen in the goggles and record it on a phone or device. So it's a pretty nice thing. Um, so let's take a look. What's, first off, these don't work. So what has come with the device isn't going to work, and there's no instructions. It's just, this is exactly what you see. What What you see here is exactly what's in the box and you're like what the hell uh, thank god there was some youtube videos so that you can figure out what's going on so i thought i'd throw one up for people too to help so this thing if you're going to need a cable like this this is the cable you'll need it's a regular usb cable and i have a usb adapter on there that came with my phone so if you have a phone whatever you'll need an adapter that goes into your phone uh, so that it will actually be US because this, this end is just regular USB. See if I... So this end is just regular USB you can see and it just goes into this USB adapter and then the other end obviously goes into the device. So once you get a regular USB charging cable like this and you get your adapter for your phone you're going to go ahead and open up the app, which is exactly that app right there. So they don't even tell you that, so I had to find that out from online too. Now, it tells me that it's not connected, which is fine, but we're going to plug it in now. Once you plug it in, this is what you have. That's what it should look like. It's going to go through and find your camera. So let's just turn on our little quad here. And you can see the image is very nice. And the interesting thing about this is there's very little latency due to the fact that it's actually radio. So, and it's clear. It's even clearer than the goggles. So I think this is pretty damn nice. Um, you can also use it to fly if you would like by doing that. And you would have very little latency. Actually, this might be preferable to using your goggles. Um, I might, I, I have to try that. Uh, the goggles work on this thing well. I like it, and I've even used these goggles. By the way, people have asked about this. Could you use these goggles for other drones? And yes, you can. So if you get a set of cheap goggles like this with a package, you can use these goggles um, with other drones. What I've done here is I've included or added some extra foam to it to increase my focal length for my eyes. <laughs> it also makes it darker and much more comfortable. Uh, I took that foam off of another pair of goggles. But you can see here that the, the quality coming out of this is not bad, obviously. Uh, but the quality coming out of this may be even better. And, um, you know, you have very little latency, which is nice. Um, so it seems to be pretty damn good. You could even put a up more uprated antenna on here, so that's good too. It's pretty cool. So this product, this is how you use it if you want to use it.